Hi everyone, welcome to Kyla's Coloring Corner. <coughs> I'm a little early, so <coughs> I'm just waiting on a few people to come on. <coughs> <coughs> Hi, Kim. Okay. <coughs> Kayla, I gave you your binky and you got your tablet. Now be quiet, okay? <coughs> we'll cut that down because Nanny's streaming. I did. This fly don't bother me until I start to stream. This fly don't bother me until I start to stream. Turn this down. Hopefully it won't. <laughs> my phone's not on the internet. I'm not sure my camera's on. It's been acting off. Have you got my cable out of here? Hi everyone that's joined. Thanks for joining. Okay. I need to plug it up. Well, I'm just going to go ahead with the video. Um, it says 12 people's here. I don't see Kim's eating. Maybe a couple people will come along, but I've got a few things. Can you call her tablet down? Um, I got the Hannah Corals on, a winter postcard book that I really wanted. I got it. This is a few things that's came in the last couple days um, that I got. Let's see, put it back right there. And then I got this little coloring book. Um, it's just a little coloring book. And then for Christmas, I got one of my Christmas books that I've, I wanted um, by Ruth Sanderson. And if y'all want to flip through of any of these, let me know. I'm not seeing the chat. Okay. Hey, Lori. Go see what's going on. Why am I not seeing the chat? Hold on one second. My chat's not showing up. Oh, 
Okay, now I can see y'all. Hey, Lori, sorry I missed you. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay. Um, just a little down today, but I'm okay. My sisters are here. Yay. So I got Santa's Christmas Grayscale Adult Color Book by Ruth Sanderson. I got Geomorphia by Kirby Roseanne. I got Fantasy Kingdom by Juliana Emerson. And if y'all want to see a flip through of any of these, let me know. Guess what I got, Lori? I got a Romantic Country, but I got the second tail. And I do want the first and the third tail now that I got one of them. So I've got to get the first and set a third one, but I've got the second one. I got Hidden Paradise, which I love absolutely love I got mythographic which I love and I've already started a picture I'm doing the doodles in gel pen and then the animal and pencil I believe I've seen it on Danny Button's channel so I've started this one all I gotta do is the frog now I think it turned out really cute and then I got the colorful unicorns by color it I got it's coloring book and then I got a color by number. You want the unicorn one? I got the color by number, um, volume three. And I've done, I'll show you. I can't really show you a flip through of this one except for the back. But i done this one in colored pencil. This was my first one i done. And then i done, I've really been working. This is like mindless coloring or not thinking coloring i love this book i love it and i've got a few more coming i done this lizard and gel pen and marker and then i just got done with the outline of alice i'll be doing it tonight or tomorrow or whenever um let's see what number is alice 17. So you kind of have like answer key to who it is in the back. Hi, Natalie. Thanks for joining. So I've done the outline in this. So you just do the outline. Number one is usually black, and it's the outline. And then you color it in. You see a couple times I've messed up, but and I do that with a pit pan normally. I love unicorns too, Kim. Have you seen a flip through of it yet? If not, I can do a flip through of any of any of them. Um, I do want to color one of these, but I've got a few pages that I'm going to let y'all vote on. I got ha some Halloween pages that I'm going to color today, but this is a really cute book and it's smooth paper. So it'd be good marker paper, Kim, really good marker paper. And when I get my own place, Kim, I'm going to, if you don't mind, I'm going to need your email so I can get your address because I have some markers I want to send you. Hi, Rachel. Thanks for joining. I just showed my haul of books, which you already know. I've already told you. And I got the Color It Glitter set of gel pens. And these are really good, y'all. They are really good for the price. And they came with refills and a cute little box and the case. And then I got the regular Color It gel pens as well and um i've got the sergeant art gel pens on their way i told y'all those were really good gel pens sergeant art are amazing but these are good too i love their little cases the glitter ones are in this pretty glitter case i love it so hi anita thanks for joining so, if anybody wants a flip through, just let me know in the comments or in um, the chat, and I'll do a flip through of any of the books. And I have a few pictures that I've picked. Let me see what's going on with Kayla real quick, and then I'll show y'all. Give me just one second. What's going on? What's wrong? Okay, well, you need to be quiet. No, Colin, in there, she had one of the problems that is squirting it in the <coughs> What was it? 
white, whatever white bottle that is on the uh, tub. Oh, your bath wash. No, it's, I think it's your stuff. The white bottle with the pump. No, it's hers. You need to quit messing. When you go pee, you, you go up, potty. Pee okay, I'm sorry. We've got Kayla. She's being a three-year-old. <laughs> so I chose in a few pictures, a couple PDFs, and a couple out of some books. And depending on what y'all pick, is <coughs> depending on what I use to color in. But I do want to do something that's not so stressful but i haven't used pencils in a while so okay so this is the first one and this is out of um my new book um hidden paradise so this will be number one and i've chosen this one out of phantomorphia so this will be number two This one out of Tenderful Enchantments. This little bat with the pumpkins. So that's number three. And then this is out of Jade Summer's new Witches book. Number four. And here's a witch. I forget who this author is. Number five. So I have five for today. One, two, three, four, five. Well, let's go through them again. This is number five. I think this is pretty. Number five. Number four. Number three, and I've never colored out of this book, so this would be cute to color. This one right here with the pumpkins and the bat. Number four, I mean number three. That's number three. The Phantomorphia. I picked the skull with the butterflies. Number two, and then the witch is number one. Four, one, three. Three or four. Hi, Margaret. Thanks for joining. 18 people. Wow. Hi, everyone. Hi, everybody. My silent subscribers. Hey to everybody. Thanks for joining. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe our, and subscribe. subscribe and hit that notification bell and you'll know every time I'm live. I haven't been live in a, quite a few days, y'all, because... We've had a lot going on. Jeff's been sick. I had both kids. Um, we went to the fair. Me and Randy went to the fair, and then we took the kids to the fair this weekend. So I've kind of been, oh, and I got, my best friend sent me some new tea. I want to tell you about this tea. It's in a cute little tub, and it's called Citrus Lavender. It's got pineapples and all kinds of things in it with lavender and chamomile. It is awesome. You need to look at your Walmart and find you some citrus lavender tea. And it's herbal tea, and it's in a little container. Let me go get the container. I'll show you. Thank you. I like it, too. Thank you, Lori. Um, it's called T Vanna Citrus Lavender, and it comes in a little thing like this. Yes, yeah, it's, it's delicious. It says, um, Citrus Lavender is herbal tea flavored with herbal tea with other natural flavors with pineapple, orange, and notes of sage. So, Angela, I got some sage. She's not on here yet, but I got some sage for my cough. It's in here. And uh, it says, Tivina crafts vibrant blends of the finest teas and botangles to color your world with imagination. Sweet pineapple, apple, and orange zest are balanced by soothing lavender, chamomile, and a savory finish with notes of sage. It's a luscious blend of bright fruit notes alongside calming herbs. And they look so cute. I didn't open them all the way, but this is what they look like. 
like little ribbon bags. They're so cute. And it comes with 15, I think, 15 sachets, it says. So it's really good. It's really good. I suggest, she said she found it at Walmart. I suggest y'all go check it out. So has everybody voted? I'll calm down in just a minute. So Hidden Paradise is one. Phantom Morpheus, two. Tender Full Enchantments is three. Jade Summers Witch is four. And this witch is five. Hi, Tracy. Thanks for joining. Looks like three wins. That's a new Tracy. I don't know. But yeah, it does look like three wins. And I haven't. Rachel, have you put your vote in? I know she's voting for three. Okay. It looks like I need to color in this one anyways. I haven't colored in Tenderful Enchantments yet at all. So, let me put these away. And I need to decide what I'm going to um, use to color in it. And get me some card to put behind it. Let me do all that fun stuff and I'll be right back. Give me just a second. Put all my books up. My squeaky chair, I'm sorry, I can't help it. I can't see the chat right now either, guys, so give me just a minute. Put these books up. Okay. Uh, all right. And those for you that's wondering if I like Geomorphia, I do. Um, it is quite different. It's about like um, Phanomorphia, but... I like some of the pictures in it. If you haven't seen it, let me know and I'll do a flip through. Okay. So I don't want to lose my little bookmark here. I need to put it somewhere safe. I keep it in the book. Let me just put it back here somewhere so it don't fall out. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to have to get it where y'all can see. Uh, that needs to be turned down, please. I can't hear it over here. It's only. Well, it needs to be turned down a little bit, please. I'm thinking about doing some ink tints. I was thinking. I'm not sure. I might just want to do colored pencils because I haven't done colored pencils in a while. Okay, are y'all going to be able to see? If I do it, see, it's hard for me to. Let me try to adjust this. Can y'all see pretty good right here? Can y'all see pretty good? Let me know if y'all can see. Okay, y'all can see this page? Okay. Um, what color pencils do I want to use? Hmm. I've been wanting to use some watercolor, but I don't know if watercolor will do good on this paper. I know I'll do a pastel background. Um, we'll do Prismas because I have more colors in Prismas. All right. Um, what color do y'all think the bat should be? Brown? Or like a black and gray. You can't see good, Anita? I know this light's going to give shadow, but I'm sorry. I can't do anything about it. Is that better? I don't care about the warping, but I think I'm going to go with just color pencils. Um, I think we're going to go with Christmas. Let me get them out. What color do y'all think for the bat? 
browns or grays and blacks. I don't really like doing just black. Excuse me. Sorry, just hold on one second, y'all. I'll be right back. What's the deal? What is the deal? Watch what? I don't know how to get it on there. What is it? Oh, give it to me. I don't know what it is. It was my favorite song. It's just a commercial. Here, watch it. Okay. Okay, I'll be right back. Let me go put my tea up. And y'all think of a color for me for the bat. Um, well, this bucket is going to be brown. So what's a good color to do the bat? I just don't like doing black. I'll have to do like black with gray, like dark grays. Y'all help me come up with a color. Guys, give me just a few minutes. I got to go make Jeff's bed really quick. So I'll be right back. Just give me just a few seconds and I'll be right back and we could start. Hi, Elaine. Thanks for joining. And y'all help me come up with the back colors and the colors for the picture. The pumpkins are going to be orange. The ladybugs will be red. The leaves will be green, of course. This is going to be brown. So help me come up with this. I'll get me back in just a few seconds. Let me go make his bed real quick. He's been sick with a stomach flu and I had to wash his sheet. You're a liar. Okay. All right. Sorry, guys. All right. Yeah, y'all think purple, black and blue blended, purple. Purple and black. Purple and black would be cute. So do maybe his body like black and gray and the outline of his wings black and gray and then the inside of his wings purple and the inside of his ears purple. 
and like his belly purple. <coughs> what do y'all think about that? Hi, Elaine. Thanks for joining. Thanks, everybody, for coming. I really appreciate it. I haven't streamed in a while. So I thought, why not? I'm glad y'all picked this book because I really need to do something in this book. So how's everyone doing? And how's everybody's weekend being? And what are y'all all up to? What are y'all coloring? Let me get some colors out. So we're probably going to need black. Would y'all say black with warm grays or cool grays or French grays for the bat? I've never colored in this book yet, Lori. I'm fixing to find out. Y'all think warm grays, cool grays, or French grays with black? So he'll be more like grayish, a darkish grayish color with purple. I'm thinking like a dark purple. <coughs> you think warm? What does everybody else think? Warm, cool, or French grays with black? Cool, you think? We don't have to be quiet. He's going to sleep. He'll go to sleep because of his coloring in secret garden. Cool. Yeah, I think I'm going to do cool grays. Okay. Let me get my cool grays out. Turn her tablet down a little bit. You turn it down or it goes off, Kayla? One of the two. Well, it's going to die anyway. The tablet's going to die. Oh, she needs to go to bed then. Okay, I got the cool grays out in the blacks. So let me pick what purples. I know I want dogs to seem purple hue. Let me do this. And then I got to get my little book to keep up with the colors that I use. Um, <clears throat> I have a bunch of. You finished that book, Lori? Cool. I think I have the, um, are you talking about Johanna Basford's Secret Garden? I have the artist edition of that one and the regular one, I think. I've never colored in them. I may end up giving them away because that one, all of them except for Ivy and the Inky Butterfly, which I don't color in it either, but I'm going to start using it as um, a test for different mediums, I think so I can use it. Um, black grape usually goes good. Docks the same purple hue. Black grape. Um, maybe some violet. Maybe. I like the dahlia purple. I like dye your purple better than I like violet. Okay. And then maybe parma brown. And maybe some lavender. We'll see. <coughs> um, I use all sorts of pencils, but I'm using Prismas at the moment, Margaret. So we'll get that out and I'll go ahead and get the browns out. I always use the same brown combos for some reason. Um, I might need a little bit of sepia right now, but I'll just have it out just in case. Light amber, dark brown, chocolate, and dark amber. What happened to Kim's message? Why don't you erase your message, Kim? And then oranges for pumpkins um i haven't colored pumpkin oh okay i haven't colored pumpkins this year so we're gonna do that one looks good pumpkin orange 
and maybe just orange or then orange. I need some greens. And I'll do the reds for the ladybugs and things like that as we, as we get to it. Oh, okay. That's fine. Mm. I'll do the greens for the stems, but the other colors, I might want to change up the greens on the leaves and stuff. So we'll get to that when we get to it. But I'm going to go ahead and do a dark green for the stems. Use an olive green. Trying to use some colors I don't use that much. Um, maybe green ochre. And let's try kelp green. Yeah, we'll do those greens. Okay, I think I got enough to start with. Oh, we got to do the person's face. Of course, I've got to get my face colors out. Light peach, peach, and nectar is probably all I'm gonna do. And maybe, yeah, that's all I'm gonna do. I don't know about the little clothes or the hat yet. We'll get to that when we get to that. Okay. Alrighty. Let me do a little sharpen on some of these babies. So I'll have them ready. I do like my M&R sharpener now. I finally got it where I like it. I hope Angela's okay. She's normally here. She must be going to bed early or something. She's normally here. I need a little, another little mason jar to keep the pencils that I'm using, or one of these cleaned out, so I can keep the pencils I'm using in it. Have y'all talked to Tasia today? I wonder where she's at. She must be tired from school today. Yeah, I'm getting into um, some water markers and some gel pens and different mediums that I didn't think I would be into. And watercolor, because in my Color by Number book, I've got hooked on that book. And then the Mythographic book, I can use different mediums in that book. And I plan on using gel pens and things for all the doodles. And I might even do that in Kirby Roseanne's books. And then... Um, do pencil for the main the animal or the main thing in the picture i think that'll help me get through some of the pictures <coughs> i might even try that in forest girl i'm waiting on i'm gonna get some flowery like cherry blossoms and other flower washi tape so i can do some of the bedspreads and stuff in forest girl and washi tape i haven't seen her either So my mods are here. Y'all keep a lookout for me. We don't like drama on this stream. We're not going to have it. They'll get booted. Positiveness here, and that's it. Ain't that right, girls? Ladies. All right. I'm almost there. Sorry, I haven't started yet, and we're, how long have we been on? 34 minutes, I still haven't uh, colored anything, but that's okay. Because I'm sure y'all are all right, right? Are y'all okay to be here with me through it? We got to sharpen. Yeah, don't mess with nothing. Yeah, I'm going to be coming in there to check on you, so you better potty, and you better wipe and flush, and that's it. Don't be messing in nothing. 
I will be checking on you. She's running. Um, I think he went to bed. We got to turn the TV and shut the windows and stuff. He likes me to turn it off when he goes to bed. All right. That's because he was drunk. Okay, thank you, Lori. Just got so much going on here. That's why I ain't streamed in a few days because I just got a lot to take care of here and got quite a bit going on. And I like to stream when I'm by myself, but I haven't been by myself, so I'm just going to have to deal with it the way it is. All right, give me one second. I'll be right back and then we'll get started. I'll be right back. Did you wipe? Yeah. Did you flush? No. Don't run. Do not run. Walk. Death. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, guys. Okay, I'm not seeing the chat. Has anybody said anything? Y'all here? Give me the drink. All right. Let me get my little book to keep up with what we're using here. Oh, I did a Misfits picture since I've streamed. And y'all know I haven't colored in Misfits and did not know how. But I'm going to show you because I'm proud of her. <laughs> no, I'm chatty chat. <laughs> Everyone's coloring. Okay, that's fine. But I did this picture. And I did it with um, my whole binds. I think she came out pretty good. I didn't do a background because I didn't think she needed one. But I did that. I'm proud of her. I think I'll color another Misfits picture. But I'm wanting um, the volume two, the zombie one, or a different one. Because I don't too much care for the first volume one. Okay. I'm going to write down Tenderful Enchantments. Thank you, Lori. And we're going to do... Do you got that on right? Mm -hmm. Bat oh, and pumpkin page. Mm -hmm. All right. I'll let him. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and get the skin over with. Put the kitty down. Nectar, peach, peach. I'm going to get the skin done, and then I think I'm going to move probably to the bat and then the basket, maybe. Hi, Angela. I was wondering where you are. How are you doing? Glad to see you. Um, I'm doing a picture and tenderful enchantments. We're doing this bat with the pumpkins and I'm using Prismas. So I'm going to take the light peach 
just go over the skin. I'm gonna have to have a little bit of light. I hope that don't. You're probably gonna have to have a shadow. I don't know why you just cut the notice. I'm sorry about the shadow. There's nothing I can do about it, guys. Here in a little bit, I'm gonna have to turn off the big light. I might have to plug up the other lamp over here too, so they can go to bed. Randy's gotta work tomorrow, and Kayla needs to go to bed soon. JB Christmas. What's JB Christmas? Oh, I got a few books you'll have to watch back. Oh, okay. You'll have to watch back at the new books that I got. Um, I got Hidden Paradise, a, a Ruth Sanders one, the Grayscale Christmas one. Um... The Color It Unicorns book, Gia Morphia, the Myth Mythographics, um, some Color It gel pens, um, Summer Nights by Hannah Corzon, and a few other ones. You'll have to watch it back. I hadn't heard from you in a while. This weekend I was too busy to call you or anything. We took the kids to the fair. My eye, I think I re-scratched it because it's giving me really bad trouble today. It's been watering really bad and hurting on the left side of it. I don't know what I've done. I hope I didn't re-scratch it and reinfect it because it hurts really bad. I've got to plan my son's baby shower. Um... I was supposed to do it this weekend, but I'm going to do it this week. We're going to have it in the middle of next month. He didn't text me back. Well, I may want to get off here to text her again or call him. He didn't text me back. I hope everything's okay. We've been looking for a place. We still haven't found a place. Hopefully, we'll be moving within the next week or so. As soon as we find something. Hi, Ollie. I bet that was funny, Angela. We took the kids... Um, Saturday to the fair and I was pooped. They wore me out. If my internet happens to go out, it's because both of them are on tablets. So I'll just have to start another stream just so y'all. Yeah, I can see you because I'm on my other account on my chat. I don't know why I can't see you on my um, coloring um, one. I have no idea. I've I've worried myself sick trying to figure it out, and I still can't figure it out. So I just log in on this one, and sometimes when I'm in other people's chats, I log in on this one like Tasia's so I can see you, Ollie, because I don't like not seeing you. <laughs> but welcome. Thanks for joining. I'm coloring at a Tenderful Enchantments, coloring this little guy with his bat and pumpkins. <laughs> Thank you, Angela, for telling everybody thumbs up. We've got 23 people watching. Thumbs hmm. up. You want to tell them, Kayla? Mm -hmm. Take that out of your mouth before you come over here and talk. And don't yell. Jeff's in the bed. Kayla's got us something to tell everybody. Thumbs up. Tell them, hey. Hey. Thumbs up. <laughs> All right, go lay back down. Okay. She's been a mess. 
I had her brother too all weekend. He went home yesterday and now I have her. She's going back tomorrow. Thumbs up. <laughs> Ollie said, hey, back at you. Rachel's on here too, and Angela and Lori and Kim, everybody. I forgot to do, she's watching her tablet, so she's not interested. <laughs> Me and her colored a little bit earlier. I want to get her some color by number books. Angela said, hey, Kayla, sweetie. <coughs> Say hey to Angela. Kayla, yeah. say hey to Angela. Hey, Angela. Okay. And Anita said hey. She's my niece, Anita, but she's more like my daughter. We've raised her since she was three months. Uh, my daughter is almost 17, and she's got a grand, my granddaughter on the way, and my son will be 20 in March, and he's got my granddaughter on the way. <laughs> I got two granddaughters. One's due in January and one's due in February. I'm in February. And little Kayla's birthday's in February. February the 1st, she'll be four. Kim said, hey. Yeah, she's a cutie, Ollie. <laughs> and she knows it. And thank you. She's the boss, she thinks. Say hey to Kim, Kayla. Say hey to Kim. Kim? Say hey, Kim. Hey, Kim. <laughs> oh, really? You say you're kind of like me, Anita, huh? Hey, Kim. You get into it once. I thought I would have a grandson by my son because I already knew my daughter was having a granddaughter, but we went and I'm having two granddaughters, but that's fine with me. I'm just glad that they're both healthy. We know that we've been to that appointment, so. Can y'all see what I'm doing? I'm taking nectar and doing my shadows. Kelly, your towel is a little loud, babe. This fly has not bothered me all day. And now that I'm streaming, it's going to bother me. It does it every time. You need to lay down and get ready for bed, Kayla, and watch that tablet. Her knee's going to take it. I'm using um, Prismacolors. I th yeah, I think they are. This daylight lamp is really bright, really bright. I think I'm going to have to switch it out with my other one when I cut the light off in a little bit because uh, Randy has to work in the morning and Kayla will be going to sleep, so I'll have to cut the big light off. But this is enough light. And I wouldn't need another light, but it hurts my eye. My eye's still real sensitive to light. So I'll probably have to switch over to my other daylight lamp. And I cut the light off here in a few minutes. That way I can still see. Why don't you follow the tablet we did? I told you, you gotta let it charge. You didn't want to let it charge. Can you get charger? No, my phone did. I told you earlier, let it charge. You yeah, need to bring the pink charge pack in. I need a charger. Hey, if you'll ask nicely, I might can find you one. If you'll ask me nicely, I might can find you one. Are you asking me nicely? Take that pink out of your mouth because I cannot understand you. Yeah, I'll ask you nicely. Can I please have a charger, Nene? Can I please have a charger, Nene? If I give you this charger, this is my special charger, so you have to be very careful with it. Okay. So, she have a thing for Let me say it. What you do is you just 
hold this with it. <coughs> hold it with your tablet. Hold on one second, guys. I gotta fix her tablet. If it's charged, I don't know if it's charged. Cause you gotta hold it with your tablet. Just hold it on the back of it like this. It is charged. You know, you're 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 gonna have to wait a minute. It's at zero percent. So let it sit here for a minute and charge for a few minutes. Cause you can't turn it on when it's at zero percent. You're gonna have to let it charge for just a few minutes, and then you can use it. Okay, I'm back. No, why did you? You just unplugged it. Now go. She's gonna give you a charger. It's just at zero percent right now. You have to wait. You don't jerk things out of a charger. That's how you break them. Okay, sorry, I have to hear her fit. She's yay, Ollie. What poly colors did you order? Poly colors. I love my polychromos, but I only have a small set. I want the full set. And did y'all see that um, the luminance went down to $170, but now they're back up to like $250. I wish I would have had the money to grab them when they were $170 because they were right at the same price as the polychromos. And the Pablos, yeah, she is tired. Um, the poly the Pablo's was down too in price, but they've went back up. I'm not sure if I want, I have a titanium buff luminance. So I'm in between. I want the polychromo set for sure for my Christmas. And then my birthday's in January and then Valentine's day and mother's day and all that stuff. So I told Randy Lee, I'm either going to get the 40 set of, neo colors or the whole set of ink tints and then i want oh okay i have those those are really good ollie and then i want either the luminance if they go back down or the pablos but the luminance i know i like because i have the titanium buff one i know i like them but a lot of people say the pablos are kind of like the polychromos I would like those if they're like the polychromos. I'm not sure. Really, Ollie? Where? Because last week I seen that the um, the 70 or what, however many you get in the set, 76, they were $170. But I will look today or yesterday and they're back up to $250. Yay, Angela. I'm proud of you. She watches her tablet to go to bed and she's upset because it's completely dead and on zero and it's got to charge for a few minutes. Oh, wow, Natalie. I didn't see that. Congratulations. What's her name? How much did she weigh? And was you in the room? Did you get to be a big part of it? I'll just stop it from charging and you won't get it at all if you don't stop. You either dry it up or you don't get it at all. Oh, wow. I need to look at that. $69. So I want the full set of ink tents, and I'll probably get those in the neo colors because those are not expensive, neither one of them. But I want just I'm probably just gonna get the 40 set of neo colors. I'd like to have the whole set, but the 40 colors are only fifty dollars, and I can make a lot lot of colors with 40 colors. I only have the 15 set, and I want the polychromos, and then I'm thinking the luminance or the Pablos, but I'm really leaning towards the luminance. Um, 
but the polycolors, polychromos for sure, because I have a lot of them. I just don't have them all, but I'm just going to go ahead and get the whole full set. That way I'll have some backups. So I'm going to get the, at least one of the watercolor, probably both of the watercolor because they're not that much. And then one expensive pencil and that's going to be my Christmas, my birthday, Valentine's Day, anniversary, all of that. So, but it'll be worth it. Hopefully they'll go on sale for Black Friday, I'm hoping. 6.4 pounds in her name is. How do you pronounce that? How do you pronounce her name, Natalie? Oh, I'm wanting to be in the room with when my granddaughters are born, both of them. I want to experience that with my daughter and my son. And my son's a girlfriend. She don't have her parents both passed away when she was two. So she doesn't have a mom or a dad. So I'm pretty sure they're going to have me in the room. And they live here in North Carolina where I live. But my daughter lives in Tennessee. So I'm going to go up there around her due date and stay until she has the baby. I stay with her in the hospital. And then I'll come back home. Isla, is it I? Wow, Ollie. That's crazy. Is it Isla? Is that how you pronounce it? Isla. Isla. Okay, Isla. That's pretty. My um, daughter's daughter, her name's going to be Brielle. Brielle Kaylee. And she's due January 15th, but I don't think she's going to last that long. She's huge. And um, my son's daughter, she's going to be a little girl, I think. She's going to be a little baby. Her name's going to be Dakota Jean, and that's she's going to be named after me. That's my middle name. Dakota Jean and Brielle Kaylee. And Kaylee's after me, too, just not Kayla. My daughter's name's Haley, so... Um, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to be around her as much because they live in Tennessee, but I'll be there as much as I can be, as much as she was supposed to come down here the first six weeks, but she's changed her mind, and she was going to do a lot of things, but she's changed her mind. She's going through some stuff. I don't know. 